Hello Arvcom, Tony R.I. here and I just wanted to go ahead and show y'all the uh, process uh, for embedding videos. Some of y'all know already how to do YouTube videos but I wanted to also show y'all uh, three other sites um, that you can actually embed in on AR15.com's video embedder. Uh, Vimeo, Facebook, and LiveLeak. And there are probably some more out there but those are probably going to be the main ones you're going to use. So first let's start with YouTube, okay? Everyone knows how to do this. You take the YouTube URL, go ahead, and here's, here's the URL as you see it here. Go back to your post, and I'm going to go ahead and put this in uh, a test post here in the, in the text port forums. Then you go ahead and do your embed uh, code. Flash width equals for four by three so that's going to be 480 in single quotes 480 height equals 385 now you whenever you embed a YouTube video you're going to want to add 25 pixels to the height of the video so this is 360 it's a 360p video embedded as such you're gonna the heights going to be 385 and then source and then you paste in the YouTube link right but in between single quotes simple all right and let's show you that Ta-da! embedded all right next we have Vimeo here's a uh, one of our very own members uh, has done for the VCDL and I'm gonna go ahead and embed this so first things first you click the embed tag now it'd be great if we could use this nice iframe uh, embed code because it works uh, doesn't use flash it works on like they say the iPad iPhone uh, works with flash not with flash whatever but unfortunately we can't so we have to click old em old embed code it's a lot more complicated so you're gonna take this old embed code into a word processor and the thing that you want is this embed source right here all this like it basically takes all those settings ah, crap did it wrong takes all these settings from the site where you can customize the options here you can select the size the colors title you want to autoplay you want to loop it etc what text you want to be seen and there's a little preview of it basically takes all that and puts that in that code so get the embed code copy it and again what you want we'll take note of the size 800 by 450 but then take the embed code now go ahead and paste use that for your link in your post and we'll, I'll just copy that and remember it was 800 by 450 so that's what you're going to use in here 50. 800. I believe 800 is the maximum width of any pictures or video that you can use on Arfcom, but I haven't checked that recently. And there you go. Alright, so next is Facebook. So you go to whatever video you have. Here's just one I'm, I have lying around on my account. You're going to copy said video. It's embed code. In. and what you're going to want is this facebook.com slash v slash the number of that video it's there under movie value or embed source now what you're going to do go to said site link this is the code you're going to want that, uh, that dot swf file you're going to want that one not the just the v code but you put paste that into a site it, then that'll give you the embed code 
So then you take that embed code and use that for the link. And again, this was a 40 by. Just verify that again. 320 by 240. It's been a while since I've worked with anything that small. So 320 by 240. And that should work without a hitch. Ta da. There we go. We're embedded. And last but certainly not least is Live Week. I've already picked out one here and what you're going to do and they're embed links you have the, f the first one's the embed code 450 by 370 so take that into your editor and again what you're going to want is this embed source or movie value that liveleak.com slash e slash number underscore whatever take this and again just like Facebook paste that into the site in fact you look at this, it's the liveleak.com slash view question mark i equals. So you can just replace all that with slash e more than likely. But we'll go ahead and do this. That gives you this liveleak.com slash mp.fstwf and all the stuff that'll link it to that the uh, video. Now, add that in to your. That is what you're going to embed. So this is what you're using. That one's going to be 450 by 370. Yep. See, super simple, real easy. You don't even, in, in, just like I showed, you don't even have to have the WYSIWYG editor. You can just use a plain old text editor if you're fine with typing in uh, the code every time you need to use it, or copy and pasting it. And let's show y'all how that's working. Yep, that's working. That's working as well. Hello, I'm Rich Anderson. This video today will examine the proper Hopefully, my computer doesn't melt down. All embedded. So, as you can see, a lot of fun for everyone. So, hopefully, I was a nice little uh, help on how to do that for everyone here. Highly recommend you watch this video. It's great, great information that I've done by Matt Gottschalk. So, want to make sure to go out there uh, and a uh, happy embedding, everyone.